Hey guys, Ellen32 here, and today I've got a tutorial um, for this trading system. It's really small. It's five by five by six. If you in, like count these blocks of redstone's on, but ten bits as you do, so five by five by six. The challenge that we did was actually to try build a trading system in a five by five by five area, and I don't know you had to count the blocks of redstone was on top of, so yeah this one's six high. So yeah. So here's a quick demonstration. Um say I want to trade two gold and two iron to someone on this side. There'd be walls up here that you can't go around just so so you see there's two iron and two gold for two diamonds. And they can see there's two diamonds. So when they want to accept that this is a fair trade, you pull the levers, take your loot, and then you can pull the lever again. The next person to go. So there's a few problems with this, and a few good things. Good things, it's difficult to steal from people because they can see exactly what you're throwing in. You also can't steal from the other side. One major flaw, you can't get your stuff back. So you'd have to destroy it, bring out more glass and then place it back. So yeah. Um, so I'll do a tutorial now. So I'll turn this into one block so I can build on it. Right, so this is our starting area. If you don't like me doing it in the void map, I'm just trying this to vary things a bit. If you don't like me doing it in the void map, please just leave in the comments and I'll not do it again. If you prefer, though, you can tell me that as well. So, start off by making this, it's a square kind of, with the middle, and then the top left and bottom right corners sticking out doesn't really matter what angle it's at because then you can just change it so what you do now is place two pressure plates at this side forgot to get myself pistons and then in the middle you under these blocks you dig down one block or two Then you place a sticky piston and then some an iron block. Or oh, it doesn't need to be an iron block, I just like iron blocks now. Don't know why I just decided I like iron blocks. So then underneath you'll see these pistons. Place a block in one piston. Just check what side. Um if it's under the left piston, the pressure plate will go on the right. So wherever the pressure plate is, it's on the opposite side. And the pressure plate is always diagonal of each other. Then you place a block diagonally down from that. And some redstone. Then another side as well. Place a, um, one block diagonal from this piston. Place a torch on it, and do the same for the other side. Everything you do on one side, you'll do to the other. And you dig down one block, diagonal from the pressure plate. Doesn't need to be here, but this is probably my favourite place, because it gives it that a nice look, I think, when it's finished. So you then just fill over, so it makes this shape. Um, don't need that. And you place one water source block in the middle. What you then do is build up the walls, so it's too high. So you're back to a square or a circle, whatever you want to call it. Then place a glass block. Diagonal from the pressure plate and over this hole that's in this square circle thing. 
Then you do that. It's for the other side as well. Make a big line down the middle. And just put a roof over it. Personally, I like to place glowstone here. Because it just gives it a nice bright look inside. So, last thing you do, put... put <laughs> so with that, place the levers down in these blocks. And then, to test it works, just pull both levers. And the water will come in the gap. And that's you done. We do throw in the items. So this is a lever for a redstone torch. Put them both and collect your trade. So if you like this video, please leave a like. It's always a good thing. And if you want to see more things within a certain size, leave down in the comments what thing you want to see. In the size you want me to, or me and Tenbit to try build it in. It's just it's fun to have a challenge because Tenbit also made one in a five by five video, but it's nowhere near as good because he's rubbish. But yeah, be sure to check out Tenbit. I'll probably be doing a few more videos in this. And if you want to make a series out of this, or us to make a series out of this, where you give us a thing to try and make in a certain size. And we'll try challenge each other to it to see who can accomplish it the best or get the closest to it. Um, Lord came up with a name for it, Size Me. So if you do want to see it, please leave in the comments. Um, I hope you like this. Um, goodbye.